Alright, back in it. Last time on Shining Force. Pinch points still suck. We're assaulting around the tall, so, uh... Let's go through this door and see what awaits us. Okay, so there's another room over there. Can we go into that door over there? No, of course we can't. But we can go down these stairs. And there's a bed here. Okay. This is unspeakable. All my beloved monsters have been destroyed. Yeah, pity. Alright, so... Vank... Ernest. Ugh, are you... Are you gonna save me? You were on the PAL caravan. Who are you? My name is Jeremy. I'm the leader of the Shining Force, and I fight Runefouse. The Shining Force? Oh, so that's who you are. Feeding that pet a bob Baba's axe to Hellhound was no problem, but then... I got stuck here. I demolished that wall, but then I ran out of energy. You ran out of energy? What are you, a Saiyan? Can't move another inch. I'm meant to be taking revenge on Balbazak from my family. Come on, Balbazak is still at the harbor. You can't give up now. How can you wimp out like this? Ugh. You sure talk harsh words for a young fella. Okay, one last push. But first, I need a favor. What, are you hungry? Don't be ridiculous. No, it's nothing like that. When I broke into the fortress, it was a bit crazy. And I lost most of my men. I don't know how, but all I want, want is to defeat Balbazak. I'll join your group if you help me defeat Balbazak. Okay, Balbazak is a strong enemy. I'll be glad to have you on the team. Eh, I know you don't mean that. He doesn't get a special jingle. He's a dick. I'll be waiting at HQ. Be sure to put me at the front of the line when you take home from Balbazak. Yeah, about that, Ernest. I, I I don't see there being much importance in using Ernest. All right. Let's... Oh! Okay, that works. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, but okay. No, we don't want to deposit. What I want to do is... I want to withdraw some money because... Well... I have a feeling I'm going to need it. And... I mean, we'll come back for Nova in a bit, but I, I just... I want to uh, explore here first. Got her in his car. Guess he left it in the course of the battle. Alright, so... Uh, let's... All right. Let's revive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Is there anyone I could promote? No. I didn't think so. Well, that's very cynical of you. Alright. Still don't have enough for the repel ring. I have enough for the soul buster, but I'm still not doing it. And all you guys is the basic stuff, so... We're gonna check weapons instead. Oh, 
gonna see if we can buy some weapons. Cause I want to make sure I can out my force. Where are the people who sell the shit? Not there. I guess there isn't one. God damn, I was hoping that I could get out my guys, but there's no one to sell me some weapons. There's no one at all. So, uh, yeah, let, 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 let's... Let's do a little another. Let's do another breather episode here. The idea that my parents had fled from fighting Cerberus, the people that started the rumor were my uncle and aunt. Of course they did, those dicks. They were both good people, so why would they do such a thing? I couldn't understand it. I am Gravelitu's daughter. I'll fight with all my might. Have faith in me. Jeremy, actually, I... There's something I'm worried about. No, never mind. It doesn't matter. At night, we all slept together in one room. In summer, it was a bit hot, but in winter, we'd keep each other warm. It wasn't cold at all, and it was great fun, all of us together. Yes, it was so much fun living at the church. Well, it was until... You'll see my strength on the battlefield. That's all I have to say. What do you want with me? Don't talk to me! Have you had nothing to say to you? Got it? Deck? Why don't I tell you about the beast men are busted? The moose. These creatures are like mice. They're the smallest beast men. One would fit in your hand. The moose are a huge group. Tens of thousands of them live in Pasto Cologne. But very few people have ever seen one. They leave their lives hidden away in burrows they make in the mountains. As you might know, the giant kraken is a huge squid-like monster. Its mouth alone is big enough to swallow an entire ship, and its tentacles are as long as half the ruined continent. This monster sent both ships hurtling to the bottom of the ocean in an instant. Alright, talking to my peeps. Talking to all my peeps. Moloch! I'm a card artist. I can help you with a myriad of different battle tactics. It must be some kind of fate that has brought us together on our travels. It seems like the perfect chance for me to tell you a bit about the card. How did that mysterious card come to exist in the first place? That's where the story begins. It was bad all the Based on what would happen if we just sat around there doing nothing. The tear well would come through Bust Oak and Mount Arena and end up in Gordiana. We had a council of war. Nova, Lord Various, and the Band of Knights, and yours truly. We we'll do something to intercept that thing immediately. Leaving the battle planning to Nova, I headed for Bustoke with the Band of Warriors. It's hard for the knights to fight around those mountains, you see. When I talk to you, I start to feel a bit odd. I think I better try to avoid talking to you from now on. Sorry, right, just joking. Don't take it seriously. Oh, fuck you too, May! All I want is to do is to defeat Room Fast. I'd give my life for that cause. Ah, it's you, Jeremy. Sorry, I was miles away. I was thinking of all the sack. And the friends and fellows of mine killed by his hand. Uh, Pell. 
The name of the first warrior was Draca, the Devil Double. Well, pretty scary name, huh? His talent was phenomenal. Get this. He had an amazing trick of dividing himself into seven people when in battle. He wasn't a mage, so I wonder how he could do something like that. Maybe it just looks like seven people because he was so fast. That's what I thought, but... What other things have I got in here? Let's see! Ah, this pot! In here I've got a panacea! This ointment is effective for bites, stings, cuts, burns, frostbite, and other ailments. The only problem is... Huh, can you smell it? You use it now, but some people pass out. It's too late now. The smell is on you already. There's no need to worry. In about ten days, you'll smell normal again. <laughs> Sorry about that. I should have told you before. My steam engine's fired up and I'm rearing to go! Rock and roll! Steam Suit Secrets Part 1. The steam suit's full name is Steam Dynamic Heavy Armor. The built in steam engine's power allows the wearer to maneuver the heavy armor. And got Guns' card. The steam pangolin. Deal. Eventually, he managed to reach a higher place in the sky than anyone had ever been. It was a strange world that no one else knew anything about. Where the sky changes from blue to black, Burns saw more and more bizarre things. Alright, I think that's everybody. Uh, give me some advice, Nova. At last. It's the final battle, battle of Balbazak. Balbazak and the Blue Dragon he controls are for both formidable enemies. Beware of sea bats. Like other types of bats, they're hard to hit. Use your archers and matrons well, and try to drive them back. If you win this fight, you should immediately set sail. Replenishing items will be difficult, so prepare everything you need now. I didn't find I didn't find the uh, battle I was looking for, so and I didn't find the uh, weapons I was looking for, so I'll just go ahead and stock up here. And you know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and go into extra innings. All right, but before we go into battle, of course, we do need to save, so. All right, let's go into battle. So we definitely need archers and mages, so I think our formation that we've got is actually going to serve us pretty well. Clear in eight turns, we get the ball, the merman buster. Um, what I may want to do is... I may want to... Bring in Balbaroy. It's just a matter of who I trade out. So. Even though May is May is so close to the level, I don't wanna I don't wanna trap get her. And I like Pell. And he's got the power lance too. You know, almost everybody's got a healing seed, so I'm gonna sit Chris. I'm gonna sit Chris so we can bring in Balbaroy. Took you long enough, maggots! You chuckleheads got some nerve thinking you can defeat the army roof house! 
me and these blue boys are gonna crush you all like the bugs you are! Jeremy, Bald Attack is known far and wide for his Herculean strength. Don't underestimate him. It's as dangerous a foe as his blue dragons. Alright, so... Wait, hold on a second. Oh, defeat Balbazak and then we get a Merman Buster, okay. So let's take a look at the new enemies. Uh, we got Sea Bats on the field, as mentioned earlier. They are going to be a pain in the ass. We got Silver Knights. We got some Hell Hounds. Some Artillery. A Dark Priest. The Blue Dragon, not to be confused with the Akira Toriyama anime. And then Balba Dick. Flight on flight. That works pretty well. Alright. I guess we'll bring Jeremy right to the front line. 17 points of damage, okay. Took nine points of damage, though. Oh, flurry of attacks! Well, that's one dead, Silver Knight. Level six. I think Jeremy's getting a bit OP now. Speed by three, max HP by one, max MP by six. Jeremy just getting a little bit OP there. I need to get a healer over there, stat. Gone, that'll work. Casting heal level 2. See, 34 experience points. And Jeremy's full up. Here comes the bats. I hope they don't have the same sleep powers. That would stink. Oh, god damn it! Fucking artillery. Well, it's a good thing I healed up a bit ago. I'm gonna lose, aren't I? Well, it's a good thing I deposited all my money. Well, I, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this off on that failed take. And, uh, well, we're just going to pause for a little bit, rather. And then we'll come back and do one more.